And now that Jay Lynn Kemma has agreed to testify against her husband, where does the case go from here? Bridget Namata goes beyond the headlines. Bridget. Marissa, I spoke with former city prosecutor Peter Carlisle, who tells me murder trials where a body was never found are rare. He calls this case unusual. Carlisle has experience prosecuting murder cases without a body and says it will be challenging, but justice can be served. The mother of Peter Boy Kemma pled guilty today, told the court she was medically sound, understood the circumstances, understood why she was in front of the judge today. Um, she has agreed to testify against her husband. After 20, nearly 20 years later, why is she now changing her tune? Well, it's probably because the case has progressed to the point where she's going to be tried, and she had the potential of being tried for murder by omission. And as a result of that, she was facing a life sentence. Former Honolulu prosecutor Peter Carlisle says after Jalen Kemma testifies in her husband's murder trial, she'll be released on probation for 10 years. April will be the last time that you'll see her in a, a prison suit. So by her turning against her husband, she is evading jail time? The answer to that is she is, yes. Peter Boy's body has never been found. You can use circumstantial evidence to prosecute a case even though you don't have the body. Uh, in my experience, I handled the Langford case. In 2008, Kirk Langford was sentenced to life in prison for the murder of Japanese visitor Masumi Watanabe, even though her body was never found. And in this case, uh, with the overwhelming period of time that has passed and the testimony now of uh, the mother, mm -hmm. uh, it is a clear to me that they can prove circumstantially that uh, the child is no longer alive. Now that Jay Lynn Kemma pled guilty to manslaughter, she will be considered for release in April. This means she would have served a one-year sentence and again will be on probation for 10 years. Bridget Namata, KHON 2 News. Bridget, thank you. We were the first to tell you about today's big development through a push alert to get them via your phone. Sign up for our free KHON2 mobile app and stay with us as we continue to cover the Pia Kemmer Sr. murder case on air and online at khon2.com.